Since the bedroom has no exposed wall open in a window, to let in fresh air is not the best solution. The inhabitants intend to spend most of their time in the studio kitchen, which is also expected to be used by large groups of guests on social occasions. The corridor and the glazed balcony have no shortage of fresh air due to the ample supply of transfer air from the main spaces. However, the bathroom needs a solution for removing all doors and excess moisture. The kitchen requires a spot extractor above the stove in order to prevent smells of cooking from entering the accommodation spaces. These requirements are met with Benz Vue Heat Recovery Air Handling Unit. It is best to install the ventilation equipment in utility spaces, where soundproofing is easily feasible. It is best to install ventilation equipment in utility spaces where soundproofing is easily feasible or above drop ceiling, in furniture or decorative encloses to remain inconspicuous. This flat has a balcony which fits the bill. Since the balcony windows reach the ceiling, the air handling units are installed on the end wall of the balcony and later hidden in a cabinet mounted below the window sill level. The only element of the ventilation system requiring periodic inspection is the air handling unit, which necessitates proper access to all of its parts for convenient maintenance and repair. The air ducts are similarly mounted onto the inner wall of the balcony to be covered with the gypsum boards with a 120 mm offset. The main air ducts reach into the studio kitchen, branching into the bedroom. The rooms have enough space to hide the air ducts behind the fell ceiling with gypsum board elements. Considering the moderate air flow rate, the air duct system is made with plastic and flan ducting. 60 and 204 mm for the main duct and 55 and 110 mm for the branches. As the air handling unit is not equipped with a preheater, the fresh air temperature is slightly cool in the cold season. At maximum load, when the ambient temperatures reach the critical limits, the unit performance should be reduced to speed 1 to improve heat recovery efficiency and avoid further heat loss. The maximum capacity of the air handling unit is 250 cubic meters per hour, which is somewhat reduced due to the extra resistance of the air ducting. Based on the preliminary calculations, the air ducts will create about 100 pascals of resistance. It is safe to assume that air filter contamination will provide additional resistance of about 50 pascals. Therefore, the air capacity of such a unit within the pressure range of 150 pascals will be 120-160 cubic meters per hour depending on the filter contamination level. Bathroom air is extracted with the Vans 100 quiet style fan with the maximum air capacity 19 cubic meters per hour. Spot extraction is ensured with the Pyramida kitchen hood with the maximum air capacity 400 cubic meters per hour. To compensate for the air extracted through the kitchen hood, the wall is provided with a dedicated supply vent. The Vance Vue Heat Recovery Air Handling Unit consists of two sequential enthalpy heat exchangers with polymerized cellulose cores. The design and choice of materials result in excellent freezing resistance and absence of condensation. The heat exchanger helps recycle up to 89% of the extract air heat lost in the conventional designs. In addition to temperature, such heat exchangers also enable moisture transfer to the target air flows, which becomes a significant advantage in certain situations. For example, units with polystyrene or aluminium cores help reduce supply air humidity for improved inhabitant comfort in the cold season. The proposed air handling unit is also equipped with two electronically commutated motors with maximum power consumption 125 watt. The MV 122 volt external grills hoods are used as terminal devices for air supply and exhaust. It is important to ensure that the upper hood is used for air supply, whereas the lower one is used for air extraction in order to eliminate the possibility of reverse extract air transfer to the service space.
The hoods of the proposed type prevent vertical and slanting precipitation from entering the air ducts. The hood opening is meshed to keep falling away. The supply air is distributed by A125VR air disc valves, which have adjustable air flow rate, so that the ventilation system can be balanced with a limited number of diffusers. Now that the interior decoration work is complete, the flat looks completely transformed. The air handling unit has been installed at the balcony. Let us take a look at it. In the earlier scenes, we took you through the steps of installing the unit on a balcony wall. Thanks to a compact footprint, the unit is easily concealed within the storage cabinet. As you can see, the ventilation air ducts are kept out of sight. The main air ducts are buried inside the balcony walls, while the ducting is hidden within the suspended ceilings. To ventilate the flat, all you have to do is flick the ventilation switch. No need to open the windows anymore. Being extremely economical in terms of power consumption, such a ventilation system is perfectly suited for round-the-clock operation. Maintenance is the simple and quick. Just clean the filters a few times a year and you are good to go. Install centralized ventilation systems in your flat and enjoy the benefits of fresh air.